All right. Now, listen to this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. It all started with me leaving just a comment. All right? I left just a comment. It said, I said, he did it to me. He drove me crazy. Can you let me a cigarette? He drove me crazy. He drove me insane, telling people that I was a man and I was lying to everybody and telling everybody that I wasn't for the commu the Kanika community. He drove me insane. This guy will drive you insane, just 33. Don't fall for it. Um, I said, he did it to me. He drove me crazy for three months, I wrote him, which is really four and a half. Hold on. And I said, um, for months, and I said, you'll see, he'll say he's sorry. I'm putting a video on him right now because now he's saying he's sorry and for everything he put me through. He said, he sent Grandma Kate to tell me that he was sorry. And I will... Now, because he's saying that he's sorry for everything he put me through. He said, I said, he said, he told Grandma Kate to tell me he was sorry, but he couldn't have the decency to come and tell me he's sorry. Fuck him. I don't trust him. And let me tell you, he's going to drive you crazy for the next three months. He picks on everybody. La, 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 la. You know? So... Some chick comes over here who I don't know and says, Stasia, no, that's the, that's her last reply. She's, she goes, Wanda, now Wanda, that's a lie. He minds his own business. What world and century are you living in? Because he hasn't been doing it to you, but he's been doing it to me. Okay. And I have made many videos on him, but I take them down because I'm always the one to back down and say, you know what? He's got to be on medication. There's got to be something. So I take him down and I'm like, his personality is just not there. Like, he, you know, it's, that's how I felt. She goes, he say, it takes a big person to apologize. So you can end it and move on and keep and stop being and move on or keep being petty and keep making videos about him. How about him making videos about me? Me. He made videos about me. Okay? I never when I made the videos, they only, there's two videos, on, three videos, three. One is telling him, Tommy, leave me alone. The other one is, um, Cynthia is my receipt, and do you have receipts? Those are three videos that are up on him because he drove me insane. Like you're doing right at this moment. I said, mind your beeswax. And, and move on with your life. Stay out of it, okay? Don't play dumb. He's been talking about me like a dog. She says, Stars Cruz, my my beeswax. Do you know you're commenting on social media platform? And like, he apologized. You both said a lot of stuff. I never said nothing about him until he made 10 videos on me. I didn't even know who this guy was. He knew Cynthia. He didn't know me. So he hated Cynthia. And because I hated Cynthia, he was mad at me. But then it made him more want me. Because everybody knows that he wants me. And you'll be a dumb person not to know. She says, Um... I really don't care less if you accept his apology or not. It shows what kind of person you are. Oh, oh my God. God forbid I don't accept his apology. After he said I was a transgender, I was a man. After he said that I was Cynthia and that I had AIDS. 
Oh, 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 I should just apologize to him and let him apologize to him. Why doesn't he apologize himself? Huh? Why doesn't he apologize and send other people to do his dirty work? I said, yes, he did tell Grandma Kate to tell me he's sorry. I said, he can kiss my ass. All he does is pick on all the YouTubers. He did it to me for five days. I didn't come on, and he moved on to just 33. So just stay out of it, for real, for real. He drove me crazy day after day. He did it to me. No, uh, I said, he, did he do it to you? No, right? So... I said, so no, I never said a word, word about him. He just wants to fuck me. And it looks like all the girls subs want to start a fight with me. Cause it looks like all the girls want him, but he wants me. Can you handle that? Does it make you mad? And she goes, and I'm making, I roll and I'm making a video about this shit right now. She goes, start your good life. Like he didn't even know who Jess was. He thought Jess was a girl. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She will give his life for him. You need to calm down and take a Xanax. No, you need to take a Xanax. Cause it looks like you're on drugs. It looks like you're on drugs. On the real. She goes, why would he want me? I'm a married woman. I said, I'm a married woman too. The fuck? Being married, what does being married mean? I'm just gonna write. I'm just gonna write. <laughs> He's the one. The one. That. God Xanax in the mail. Mm -hmm. So run and get you some. Please and leave me leave me the hell alone and <laughs> just because got a ring, so <laughs> do I weigh big see you can see she here, see. See what you got to do? Let me tell you something. I'm going to say this again. If anybody, anybody says anything to my best friend, Susie, I'm telling you. Uh, I, yo, ask me, meet me, whatever. I don't care. You better leave my best friend out of your mouths. That's all I'm saying. I wrote, he still wants me. And that's all I'm going to do with this chick. Because she ain't nobody to me. You ain't shit to me. I don't care who you are. Yo, she said, because she's married. So what does that mean? What does that mean, you married? I've seen plenty bitches married. I'm fucking cheating on their husbands. Please, girl, get out of here. Get the fuck out of here. I see mad girls, their fucking husbands. 
and fall in love with other fucking people. And it looks like you're falling in love with somebody else. Does your husband know how much attention you give this man and how you defend this man? Does your husband know that? Because he should know that you're willing to give your life and even part of your crotch for him. Mm. You sound like a girl in love. You sound like you want him. You really do. You sound like a girl who wants him. Oh, but sweetheart, he doesn't want you, Miss Cannon. He wants me. Does that make you mad? Can you handle it? Ah, uh, can you handle it? You know that song, can you handle it? Ah, uh, can you handle it? Because you're a married woman and he don't want you. But I am and he wants me. And he wants me bad because he knows my pussy's nice and tight. Not like the thoughts on his fucking page who are big and wide. Fuck out of here. My pussy's too tight and too beautiful and too shaved. Please, you can never compare. Nobody could. None of your thoughts on that page could ever compare my fucking pussy. <laughs> but if you fucking come across my fucking best friend and you say something to her, we're going to have a problem. And we really are. And her name is Susie Seven. She's my partner, my best friend. So... Whoever goes after her, you're going after me. Ah, uh, yeah. You're going after me. So, do me a favor and leave her the fuck alone. Alright? She went and asked him to bring that video down. The only reason she went in his chat was to tell him to bring the video down. He said it. He, I don't know what he said. I don't know. I don't know. But I'm telling you right now. Mind your business. Stay out of it. And if you're so mad that he don't want you and he wants me, sorry. Does your husband know how bad you stick up for this man? How you're in the line of fire for him, bro. Do, do you stick up for your husband like you do for him? Wow. Really? Wow. Bro, because you sound like a woman in love on the real. You sound like a woman in love. And you know what? Sorry, but he don't want you. So you can tell your husband, you want him, but he don't want you. Anyway, I don't give a damn. I don't give a fucking damn anymore. Stay out of my business. Leave my best friend, my partner alone. She went in there to talk to him. You all attacked her. And you're lucky I wasn't there. Any, I'm in Miami right now. If any of your thoughts are in Miami and want to fucking meet up, I'm ready. I'm ready. And I got six girls with me. So you can bring six girls. All right? You can really do that. And you could pull up, too. Just let me know if you're coming, and I'll give you my address. And we could do this for real, for real. Anybody that's in fucking Miami right now in the state of Florida and you want it, you could get it too. Just let me know and we can meet up. Bro, when I tell you, a thought is a thought, a thought is a thought is a thought is a thought. A thought is a fucking thought. No matter if you marry, don't matter if you engaged, it don't matter. If you're defending another man that ain't your man, to the point that you are insulting another person, then damn, you must got it bad.